today it is time to go back in time as you can see we're on the xbox we're gonna be playing some retro fifa again we're gonna be revisiting old fifa career mode saves let's just jump right into it and start on fifa 16 it's just loaded me straight into the game okay well that save was from the mbappe video i did a few days ago which if you do want to check that one out we took Kylian mbappe and played through his career from FIFA 16 all the way up to FIFA 21. You guys seemed like you guys were going to want this one. From the last video, I said if we get a certain amount of likes, I'll revisit old career mode saves. We'll check out old my players, old normal career modes. And we're just going to explore them to see what the heck I was doing five years ago, four years ago, so on and so forth. Like I mentioned, starting on FIFA 16, which is going to be the first FIFA that I began uploading videos on, man. Oh, it feels like yesterday when we just had like freaking 5,000, 10,000 subscribers on the channel. And now we're at 650,000. I don't think I'd ever in a million years imagined we'd be here. This is going to be a fun video, especially if you have been watching the channel for a while. But if you do want to subscribe, if you are new, which I'm sure a lot of people are, you guys should subscribe. We're going to be showing off a lot of old career modes that I did on the channel. So you can also go back and watch these career modes for yourself. Just sort of Google search them or search them in the YouTube bar and you'll you'll be able to find them. Okay, man, without further ado, let's get into this video. But not before you hit the like button, we are going to go for approximately. I'm going to set a little bit lower today because you guys haven't been hitting the like goals. It's kind of making me sad, man. Why aren't, why aren't we hitting the like goals? You know what? No like goal today, man. I mean, if you enjoy the content, like it. If you don't, it's whatever. Um, it, it really helps the channel, but if you want to like, do. If not, it's fine. Okay, right. Let's get in to exploring. So where do we even begin with this, man? We got so many saves in here. Of course, we're going to have to revisit Barkley. I think we're going to have to. So let's do it. Alexander Barkley, man. We're actually starting in the FIFA World Cup, too. Wait, why is he at... Why is he at Juventus? Wait, I'm at, wait, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. So if you guys do not remember, this is the first ever my player that I did on my channel. Alexander Barkley, the American legend. Seriously, go back and watch like the first episode of this series. And you will, you probably won't think I'm the same person because back then I'm just a little kid. I'm like 17 or I think I was 18 years old. And oh my God, dude, like. I was, my voice was just, it's not the same. I wasn't as like confident as I was like speaking back then. But look at the freaky player that we made Alexander Barkley become. Like, look at these stats, man. Holy crap, that's insane. So it is a bit of an interesting one because he's on Juventus in the save. And if you guys do remember, we ended his career while he was at LA Galaxy. And like, I would never end a career mode like with the World Cup final not even being played. So... Here's what I believe happened with this save. Let me just explain this first. This is going to be a common theme you see in a lot of my saves. You'll see like Flynn 2, Flynn, Barkley, Barkley 2. In career mode, especially when you do long saves, you always got to have a backup because if you accidentally save over one, it could be gone. So I have two of like everything. So if you guys remember in the Barkley series, this is the original one. And after that World Cup, I believe we like simmed ahead in his life like five, six, seven years or so. And that took him to LA, which is right here. So to sim that far ahead and put him on LA, what a lot of people don't realize what I did was I had to recreate Barkley and I had to simulate into a career mode like 10 years into the future. No, more than 10 years. This is too, no, oh, it's about 11 years. So we simmed ahead, put him on LA Galaxy. And I believe I did make him 99 overall for that final season. So... He was pretty much unstoppable that final year. And if you guys do remember, we ended up retiring him at LA Galaxy. Well, I don't want to spoil the series because a lot of you guys have not watched it. Even though you will watch it and you'll be like, man, B4, dude, you, that was bad. Like the commentary was just bad. It's how I got to where I'm at today. So if you haven't, check it out. At least watch a few episodes and watch a few episodes of that. Watch a few episodes of my new my player. You'll see how far this channel has come. Okay, so... This galaxy save was only for one year. I want to go back to the other Barkley one. I want to see how many. I want to see how many goals we actually scored. Okay, right. So we should just be able to go to my career, and we had ourselves. I gotta move the face cam. We actually grinded this one, man. 180 wins, 48 draws, 32 losses, 211 goals, and 80 assists. And you gotta remember, this was back in the day when you couldn't simulate my player games and play and score goals. I scored 211 legitimate goals with Alexander Barkley. What do we win? Five league titles, six domestic clubs. Let's see every club that we played for. So obviously we started on Portsmouth for one season. We went to Spurs. Let's see. I want to see where we finished here. So we finished 
18th with Ports. Oh, man. No, we finished first with Portsmouth. Okay. Fourth with Spurs as well. Capital One Cup final. We won the Champions League, really, in our first season with Spurs. Wow. This is like a massive spoiler, too. So, yeah. Go watch this series if you haven't seen it. We won the Champions League with Bayern Munich. FA Cup winners right there. And Premier League winners with Chelsea. Man, look at that. We won the treble with Barcelona. And then we go to Juventus where... We did, we were in the Euros that year. Yikes. Back to Bayern Munich. Back to, a bunch of stuff's jumbled, but there's the gist of things. Those are all the trophies that we've won. Man, wow. This, the nostalgia, man. Oh, um, because this is when I was just starting out YouTube. All right, that's the first career mode we're going to be looking at. Oh my God. Wait, who's on? I want to see who's on this team. Here are all the players on the Juventus team, bro. Tava Luiz, Alexandro. We got Verotti in here. KDB was on, oh my God, it was on our team. Morata was an 88 overall. Mandzukic. Let's see who else we got. Di Maria still on the team. Chiellini, 79 overall. Oh, who else? Who else? A lot of regenerated players right here. Oh, a lot of regenerated players. We got Americ Laporte. Rugani still in the team. Damn, this is going to be probably my favorite part of this video. Is just like looking at these old career modes and like seeing who is playing. I want to see like uh, one or two more. I want to see the, the Flynn series here. This was the first goalkeeper, my player, that we did. Look at that. The legend Adrian Flynn, 92 overall goalkeeper. Oh my God, we grinded this too. So he's on Madrid. We got Pepe still. We got Ramos, Contral, Gareth Bale, 89. Wow. A freaking nostalgia with this team. Ronaldo was still on it. Wait, what year are we in here? Oh, okay. So, dude, we got we got Adrian Flynn to 92 overall in like two seasons in this career mode. So this this career mode didn't really last too long. Yeah. So we got Benzema, freaking CR7, 94 overall. Cherishev. It's uh, it's a it's one of your normal old Real Madrid teams. Odegaard. Oh, look at look at freaking baby Bruno. For, he's not even a baby. He's 24 years old in this center midfield. Bruno, man. Oh man, look at the boy Bruno. Thomas, dude. Oh man, I, I wish he stayed as good as he was. That, like, Thomas Rodriguez used to be like one of my favorite players. We got to see the the short little report here for Adrian Flynn. Started with Southampton, LA Galaxy we moved to, Arsenal, and then Real Madrid. Four clubs in total. Did we actually not win a single? We didn't win a single trophy. Okay, one more. I think this is my old Chelsea manager mode. Because we did a Chelsea manager mode to end FIFA 16. Also, if you want to watch that, it's up on the channel. This is that series. All right, I got to see who we signed in this career mode. Can I go to see, like, my transfers? Uh, let's just look. So, Portois, Serge Aurier. Looks like we signed Aurier in this career mode. We signed Rugani. We signed Baba at fullback. Let's see, we got Renato Sanchez for $7 million. I think this was only... I might not have even finished this career mode. I don't even know. We signed Kennedy. Hamas must have been the marquee signing of this career mode. Yeah, I told you guys, Hamas was my favorite player back in the day. 65 million we bought him for. Was that it? Oh, we brought in we brought in Aubameyang. Oh my god. Anyone else? Oh, look at Kadze, bro. Freaking Ngulu Kante. 79 overall for him. Um, who was that? Rafa. Did we bring in? Wow, I brought in Rafa Ron in this series. Great. I brought in Bale. Yeah, I did bring in Bale. That's right. Dude, go back and watch the series if you guys have it, man. Pretty interesting series, to say the least. Okay. I think that's all. I think that's all we have for this FIFA. On to FIFA 17 next. All right, FIFA 17. It's going to take us into that Mbappe, isn't it? No, yeah. Okay, no, we're straight to the main menu. I guess we could look at back at the journey, man. This is when the freaking journey mode began. You know, we'll hand on the journey as much as we want. My channel actually started to blow up because of this journey mode series. This was like the first series of my channel that went viral. We had a, uh, you know, let's just, let's check it out. We were doing the journey with, Ale obviously with Alex Hunter, but I signed for Man City. And yeah, this series absolutely took off. Wait, why is it saying advance? Did I, did I not finish this? What the heck? Isn't it crazy that this was in FIFA 17? And obviously the skill traits are finally being put into the my player in FIFA 22. Oh, EA, man. You guys have messed up so bad with this game. All right, let's check out our career modes here. Justin Clausen. Let's do uh, Alex Roberto first. This is the one you guys are all going to remember. Now, this series blew up on my channel, too. I would not be where I'm at without this series. Alex Roberto. What a legend. This was a really good series, man. Um, I recommend watching this one. Let's check out. So we're... Oh, I forgot we're on Leicester. 
we went on loan for our final season at Leicester. Andy Carroll, let's go, man. 76 overall. Nah, but oh, Vardy. Oh, Vardy, man. I know he's 34, but yeah, we were insane in this career mode. I mean, 96 overall cam. Look at those stats, man. That is a madness. Unreal stuff here. Um, Let's check out our career. I kind of want to like return from loan and see who's on. Wait, what team were we loaned out from? Roaned out from Real Madrid. I kind of want to see who's on Real Madrid at this point. 121 goals, 115 wins, but not as many goals as we had in the Alexander Barkley series. Let's just, let me, I need, I need to see, I need to see the assists. Let's see what it was. 70 assists, four red cards, 32 yellows. Started at Birmingham, man. We went, we went all, we, like, this is just a trend of the my player. Like we go all over the place. Damn, I didn't play as many seasons in this one, man. Yeah, some of the my players you play a full career, some of them you don't because people lose interest. Is it even possible? Oh, I'm not allowed to return from load. I can't just like, okay, um, we're not going to do that then. Let's look at this one click quickly because this one was a my player that didn't really last too long. Justin Clausen, the Dutch legend. I, I can't remember what happened to the series, but it, I, I tried to start another my player towards the end of FIFA 17 and it just didn't do that well. What was he? Yeah, we, we, we actually played 99 games, 74 goals. All right, we, we played a little bit more than I thought with this. Everton, Ajax, and Juventus were the clubs that we went to. 91 Dybala on that team too. Kingsley Komen, Ziyech. I love this. This is my favorite part is scrolling through the squad sheets. And just seeing some of the players that are in here. Okay, I want to look at one more from FIFA 17. I have no idea what you, YouTube, Juve, Spurs, all. I want to see what YouTube is. Let's check this out, okay? Mr. Manager, what are we? Okay, we're in the first season of career mode. Um, we're on Dortmund. And we have Griezmann, Aubameyang, Matuidi, Royce. Yeah, okay. Artra, okay. Um, I have no idea what this is for. This is going to be the beauty of like this right here, this video. Just looking at these old career mode saves. Like, what was I doing here? Uh, however many five years ago with this career mode save. Yeah, my tr here, we can see my transfer history. I was looking for this earlier. What was I do? I signed Pulisic. Yo, I predict. Wait, no, we sold Pulisic. Um, we sold a lot of. What was I doing here for this video, man? You know what? This might have been. I have a feeling this was like a career mode showdown or something. Someone go find this video on my channel. See if you can find a video. No, because this is the start of a season. I have no idea what I was doing. All right, boys, on to FIFA 18. We are on next. Uh, this is, I talked about this in our last video where we, we went on all these old FIFA games. This one was my least favorite. I I didn't really like FIFA 18. Big old CR7 on the cover, though. I had a Real Madrid kit, and now he's going to United in real life. All right, man, here are the menus. We got Alex Hunter again. I don't even think I finished the journey this this year in FIFA 18. I don't think I did. Okay, right. Um, no, what are we what are we doing here? Load career. All right. What do we have? Goalkeeper two, goalkeeper, Nadrid. I don't know what Nadrid means. We did a few of my players this year. So we did we did Connor Wilson, which kind this series kind of flopped, I'm not gonna lie. Even though Con Connor Wilson was a beast, man. Look at him with the the blonde hair and all. He was such a beast, but no, we did we did a lot of videos on this series, I think. I think we did over 100 episodes with Connor Wilson. Maybe. Could be wrong about that. I started to get a little lazy and repetitive with the My Player. In FIFA 20, you will obviously revisit FIFA 20 in a, a little bit later. So we'll talk about that when we get there. No, we played a good amount of time, man. We started with Swansea, LA. Wow, I loved going to LA Galaxy. I think it was because LA Galaxy Stadium got introduced in the game. So I wanted to go there. PSG, Man United. Few Champions League trophies that went in here. Copa de España, Super Cup. In total, two league titles, two domestic cups, two continental cups. This is before they could call it like, they had to call it what? The Champions Cup, yeah. And wait, how many? I didn't even see. How many goals? 181 appearances for Connor Wilson. We have 136 goals, 46 assists. All right, the squad report. So we were on Bayern Munich at the time, but we're on international duty. Neuer, Kimmich, Sule, Mendy, Tariso. These are always the most fun too. Cause, oh man, look at that. Look at that glitch where your my player's face was like so small. EA just, I guess, just did not care to fix that at all, did they? But uh, these my players are fun because like I wasn't the one signing these players. The CPU was signing them. So it's funny to see like some of the like weird signings that uh, some of these clubs have made. A lot of regen players though. 
What's this still playing in this? Rudy Iba or Rakitic. I see who's on the England team, man. I, wait, I actually want to see. what What is this? This is the 2022 World Cup, right? Yeah. Qualifiers, at least. Okay. We got to see who's on the England team, man. Pickford, Kane, Rashford, the Ox. It's funny to see. This is who FIFA 17, FIFA 18 predicted would be on the 2022 World Cup team. Let's see how many of these are correct. All right. Harry Kane was correct. One. Rashford, two. Ox, no. No. Uh, Word Prowse, three. We'll give it to him. Uh, no Gray, no Barkley, no Redman, no Deli Alley, really. Line, no. Keen. Was Keen? Well, Keen. No, nah, I'm going to say no for Keen. Luke Shaw is a good one. Man, that, that was the team? Yikes. Crazy how things can change with, uh, yeah, just a few years or so. I mean, this was like six years in the future. Oh, no, this is FIFA 18. So that would have only been like four years in the future, I guess. All right, we got the goalkeeper career mode right here. Lucas Lorenzo. Was this him? This was a this was a really good series. This one sort of rebounded the Connor Wilson. This one had a really interesting storyline. I recommend going watching the Lucas Lorenzo goalkeeper. I need to, I need to bring a goalkeeper career mode back for FIFA 22, man. I really do. People like really loved the goalkeeper career mode, and so did I, because it's like something unique. You know, it's something you don't normally get to see, and uh, no one really does a goalkeeper like my player on the channel. Here's the team, man. It's funny to see. Some of like the wonder kids on this team and like which ones are like did well in the game but actually like flopped in real life. Hamas, we've seen a lot of Hamas today, man. Luca, Luca Modric. Yeah, okay. A lot of my you can tell a lot of my, my players went to Real Madrid. We did a few seasons, actually only three. Fulham, Liverpool, and Real. That was it. I mean, these goalkeeper ones were always at the end of the FIFA cycle, so you had to end it sooner or later because the new game was coming out. All right, hold on. I want to look at. I want to look at one more of these. Um, right. Um, show. What do you think show was? Um, okay. A lot of these are just backup saves. Sometimes I would use this to get multiple transfer offers. Like I'd get an offer from Real Madrid, and then I'd save it to make sure we got the offer. And then I'd sim more and so we could get multiple offers. That's like the cheat code to get multiple offers in career mode. All right, boys, FIFA 19. Let's exit. Dude, it keeps auto loading me in to this Mbappe rewind video. Okay, here it is, man. FIFA 19. Okay, we had JJ Williams career mode. I'm trying to think what else we had, man. Again, this is the ah, yay, man. Giving us four save slots. Those Freaking scumbags, man. This was JJ Williams. I thought this series was going to be a lot bigger. It was like JJ Williams was the main character. And then we had his like best friend as well. What was his best friend's name? Oh, no, I'm not going to remember. <laughs> Would you look at this, man? We're back on Real Madrid. I, wow, I had a real problem going to Real Madrid, didn't I? Anishius Jr. at a 91. Okay. I mean, we did play a few few seasons in this at least so many regen players too that's how you know oh look at asensio that's how you know you played a career mode long when you have all these regen players the jj williams was nine ended up being 92 overall you see all of his stats right there i mean he was a pretty sick player like look at him bro cam i don't know i don't know what it is i guess some of the storylines just ended up getting stale i don't know let's see it man we played 100 games so We've started to play less and less games as the FIFAs have gone. 71 wins, 59 goals, 54 assists. Yet again, after that, we transitioned to a new my player. What was the FIFA 19 one? It what Julian Weber. That's right. Okay. Yep. Our boy, the German legend, Julian Weber. Weber. Oh, man. He's got the flow as well. Let's go. I started him out with short hair, and then I think we grew his hair out. Kind of like that. that. I like that hairstyle. Bro. What, what was I thinking, man? I'm on Real Madrid again. Every career mode. I literally went to Real Madrid. What, am, what was I doing? I need to go back in time and literally slap myself in the face. Like, what the heck, man? Kylian and Bappe, okay. We, did, we didn't grind this one. This this one was a few seasons. I got, I got lazy and the views went down and... Hey, what are you going to do? I don't know. Ronaldo just never left Real Madrid, though. All these career modes that we had... Where we're at Real Madrid, Ronaldo's always on. Wait, what? Messi? Oh, Messi was on Real Madrid too. Um, what was the save, man? Holy crap! Okay, maybe that's why. 
Maybe I saw uh, both Messi and Ronaldo at Madrid in this one. I was like, all right, I'll go back again for like a 10th time. As you can see though, Julian Weaver, he actually almost played as many games as JJ Williams though. 70 goals and 92 appearances for him, not bad. Okay boys, FIFA 20 and then I guess we may as well look at FIFA 21, but we'll look at like the Raul Hernandez and we'll, we'll look at some of the, the my players we did this year. This is my favorite, like it's, it's kind of my favorite time of the year when you know we're we're slowly waiting for FIFA, the new FIFA to come out. So we're doing some retro FIFA stuff. If you guys want to see more retro FIFA content, please let me know what we should do down below in the comments. <laughs> Yo, the last thing I did on this was make FaZe. I put FaZe in FIFA. Well, wait, this is actually so funny, man. All right, I did a whole entire FaZe career mode. FaZe Brawny, FaZe Rain, FaZe B Ford. Apparently I was in FaZe. All right, man, we got to visit the most legendary the most legendary my player that ever was the man the myth the legend rafael ruiz the absolute goat man here he is oh dude this was what a fun series to make oh my god so we left off dude we played so many games two two thousand and thirty that is ridiculous all right i want to see how many goals did we score in this 239 goals we were so close to 100 assists as well look at this okay six league titles four domestic cups four continental continental cups i can't speak look at all the teams man befica napoli bayern barca arsenal real madrid real madrid again of course can't forget them leeds united there it is ggs man oh my god squad hub so we ended on leeds united right yeah we had sancho that's right we ended on Leeds and it was like we got recruited to come to Leeds United and then they signed up. They signed Mbappe. They signed Sancho. Who else did they sign? Um, Hudson Adoy. A few others. Tonali. We ended up just like, oh yeah, we just like revamped this entire Leeds United team and just made them into a superstar club. Dean Henderson is the keeper. Wait, hold on. What were what was Ruiz's final stats? I have to I have to see that. Oh, that's right. We made him a midfielder too for the final season. Man, I <laughs> this honestly wasn't even that long ago, but I've just recorded so many like other FIFA videos in the meantime that I just forget about this stuff. He had every trait too. Dude, Ruiz. I mean, can we get a freaking thumbs up? And if, I, I don't know, the respect in the comments for the, the career that was Rafael Ruiz. Here's the thing, man. After that Ruiz series, I tried to, you know, do a little mini series and people were just like, no, we tried to do this Rafinho series and we just couldn't do it, man. People just like, nothing could top the Rafael Ruiz series. Even to this day, I don't know if I can top it. What about this though, boys? The online career mode from last year. Do you guys remember that? I don't know why I had a save for it because we didn't really do stuff through career mode, but this was, I guess this was at, at least at one point, this was my online career mode team. I drafted Rashford, Vinicius, Felix. I traded, uh, I don't even, I, I can't even remember which ones I drafted and which ones I traded for. I know I traded for Virgil van Dijk at one point. What a fun series, man. I don't know if we'll ever do anything like that again. Hopefully next year in FIFA 23, EA just add an online career mode so we don't have to set all this stuff up. Let's check out one more save because I saw something with Wilfred Bonnie. This must have been a Wilfred Bonnie rewind, I think. Or no, maybe not. Um, I must just have been saved over that. Okay, well, this is all the phase players on Brighton. Okay. Um, I must have just been doing a phase video back then. So I guess we end with this, the game that we've been playing every day for the past year. Not really much to revisit right here. I would like to go revisit. This actually does feel like forever ago. This is the Raul Hernandez save. No, I just load into the old one. All right, here we go. This is a rare occurrence of me because I did two of my players this year. We did Raul Hernandez, which low-key kind of flopped it, it didn't turn out how i like kind of hoped it would have i actually feel so bad about this one i i ended the series on a cliffhanger but it was such a good decision for the channel listen boys when a series isn't doing well you, you sometimes just have to stop and you have to try something different this my player although a lot of people liked it was not getting a lot of views. We were getting like 70, 80,000 views a video. And I, I started, I wanted to stop this. I wanted to do more experiments and it kind of saved the channel because I started doing experiments and now you see my videos, they're getting like, almost, we're almost getting 200,000 views a video. Sad that we had to end this one in a cliffhanger, but it was for the, it was for the channel, man. It kind of saved the channel this year and we would not have this many subscribers if I kept this series going till the end. We did, however, play a lot of games. 
94 goals, 156 wins at 109. I needed to play one more game to get 200 appearances. But I did want to start a new my player after Raul Hernandez, though. We did the Jarvis Brothers series, which ended only like a month ago or so. Actually, now they think of it as probably like two months. But I put a lot more thought into the series. I wanted it to be a mini series. We had a good story from start to finish. And the Jordan Jarvis series. Go watch it if you haven't. There it is, boys. A little bit of a different video, man, because, you know, we're in this weird state. FIFA 22 is going to be coming soon. I'm just, I'm, I'm recording some fun videos for you, some retro videos for you guys. Comment section, let me know what you guys want to um, see next on the channel with retro FIFA and whatnot. We get a few more videos left, and then we're going to have some FIFA 22 videos coming very, very soon on the channel, so subscribe for that. And with that, boys, we will catch you for another video tomorrow. See you then. Peace. I couldn't pinpoint on the globe, so I wanted to go from me. Just know that I don't fit in, but I wanna feel everything, yeah, everything.